Viral Science, the home of creativity. Hey friends, welcome back. In today's video, I will show you how to make this airsoft time bomb with Arduino. Now, this bomb is not an explosive bomb. It is just a prop bomb. You can use this bomb for filming or even you can play with this bomb. Now, this bomb is the model which is used in the CSGO game. That is Counter-Strike Global Offensive. If you have played, you will definitely know this bomb. This is the model which is used in that game. And in today's video, I will show you the, all the electronic stuff, which is the display keypad, the Arduino inside it. I will show you the, all the connections, the circuit diagram and the coding for this project. Then you can make this system for yourself and you can even use any of your favorite bomb models and apply this complete system over it as I have did for the CSGO model. So friends, I hope you like this video, then do hit that like button and let's quickly get started with this video. This video is sponsored by Ultium Designer. It's a professional grade PCB designer software company. You can design high quality PCB with advanced routing engine that includes powerful tools. You can visualize your PCB in 3D format. So immerse yourself in visually stunning, photorealistic 3D world of your PCB design with Ultium PCB Designer. Start your free trial now. Links are in the description down below. So for this project you will need Arduino, a 16 into 2 I2C LCD display, a matrix keypad, some LEDs, you can even use RGB LED, a buzzer and a breadboard with few jumper cables. Now follow the circuit diagram and make your connections. Now open the code. Now this is the 16 into 2 LCD display hex address and these are the pins for the LEDs. And over here we have the pin defined for the matrix keypad. If you are using the matrix black keypad then you have to replace these numbers. And just select the board. Select the port and upload the code. So first we'll set a password for our bomb. I'm setting 0000. And now we'll set the time. I'm setting my bomb for 1 hour. 
and now we'll press hash button to start the bomb. So now the timer has started. So to defuse the bomb we have to enter the password again. So for that we'll press the star button and now we'll enter the password. If your attempt is wrong the time will be reduced in half. So when I set the timer for 1 hour it's reduced to 30 minutes. Again we'll enter the password. If you have done any mistake you can press the hash button to reset your password. Now we'll again enter it. So the password is wrong and the bomb has exploded. So now I have made a replica of the CSGO game bomb. So here it is, you can see the look. I have made it with the cardboard and also stick the same sticker which is available on that bomb and it looks very similar to it. So now let's test this bomb. So friends I hope you like this bomb and this video as well so don't forget to hit that like button and also don't forget to share this video with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for such projects and I will see you in the next one. Do subscribe and press bell icon to get instant notification for new video.